Hey guys, so today we're going to be taking a very important topic that's the computation of harmonics, also known as the harmonic analysis. Questions from here are very, very important, so do practice them in plenty. Now, let's quickly start off. Let the function f of x be a periodic function defined on the interval 0 to 2l, then the Fourier series is given by f of x is equal to a0 by 2 plus summation of n is equal to 1 to infinity a n cos n pi x by l plus summation of n is equal to 1 to infinity b n sin n pi x by l. So basically what is harmonic analysis? It is the process of finding the Fourier series for a function given by the numerical value. It is the process of finding the Fourier series of a function by uh, by the numer given by the numerical value. So f of x is equal to a0 by 2 plus a1 cos x by l plus bn. So we are just basically putting 1 and then 2 in the formula above. Okay? So it becomes a0 uh, by 2 plus a1 cos x by l plus b1 sin x by l plus a2 cos 2 pi x by l plus b2 sin 2 pi x by l plus a3 cos 3 pi x by l plus b3 sin 3 pi x by l. So basically this is nothing but for n is equal to 1, n is equal to 2, n is equal to 3. So this is nothing but your first harmonic. This part will be your second harmonic and this one will be your third harmonic. So the coefficients of the Fourier series are given by a0 is equal to 2 into the mean value of f of x in the interval 0 to 2l. For the first harmonic, we have a1 is equal to 2 into mean value of f of x cos pi x by l in this interval. b1 is equal to 2 into mean value f of x sin pi x by l in the same interval. This is your second harmonic. This is your second harmonic, 2 into uh, mean value of f of x in cos pi x by l in um, the same interval and so on it goes on and on. So let us take a question under the harmonic analysis. Find the first, uh, first second harmonic analysis of the Fourier series given by x and you will be given a table basically. Take care. So what is your formula? f of x is equal to a0 by 2 plus summation of n is equal to 1 to infinity a n cos n x plus summation of n is equal to 1 to infinity b n sin n x. Okay? So then your Fourier series for two harmonics will be f of x is equal to a0 by 2 plus a1 cos x plus b1 sin x. Here we are substituting 1. Take Plus, what will be your second harmonic? a2 cos 2x plus b2 sin 2x. So now we have our first harmonic, second harmonic, your first term. Now we will be making a table with the headings x, f of x, cos x sin x, cos 2x sin 2x, y cos x, y sin x, y cos 2x, y sin 2x. Okay, and if you are asked more than two harmonics, you will continue accordingly, okay, according to your question over here. Then, the, uh, the table which is given to us, we are going to be placing all these values into our x and f of x's column. So, here we have it. So first we have x is equal to 0, f of x is equal to 1.0. So what will be your cos x? Cos x is cos 0, that is nothing but 1. Sin 0 is 0. Uh, cos 0 is again 1. Sin 0 is 0. And so on and so forth. We'll just continue. Just placing the values and we will... Okay, we'll sh uh, I'll show you another one. So 60. So cos 60 is what? Cos 60 is 
जीरो पॉइंट फाइव साइन सिक्सटी साइन सिक्सटी इज जीरो पॉइंट एट सिक्स सिक्स राइट कॉस वन ट्वेंटी कॉस वन ट्वेंटी इज माइनस पॉइंट फाइव साइन वन ट्वेंटी इज इक्वल टू जीरो पॉइंट एट सिक्स सिक्स सो बेसिकली वी आर जस्ट प्लेसिंग द वैल्यूज एंड वी आर गेटिंग इन जस्ट कीप अ कैलकुलेटर क्लोज टू यू एंड वील जस्ट बी प्लेसिंग द वैल्यूज वन टू वन फोर माइनस जीरो पॉइंट सेवन वन पॉइंट टू वन टू फोर similarly when we fill all of these whenever we fill this one's value into this we'll be getting for 120 we'll be getting minus 0.8666 minus 0.5 0.866 minus 0.5 uh, 0.95 1.6454 माइनस पॉइंट सो बेसिकली वी आर जस्ट प्लेसिंग ऑल ऑफ दीज वैल्यूज इन टू दिस प्रोडेंट ऑफ योर कैलकुलेटर एंड यू विल बी गेटिंग द फाइनल एंड देन वी टोटल ऑफ द कॉलम्स ऑफ एफ एफ एक्स वी गैट एट पॉइंट सेवन साइन टू एक्स का टोटल एज माइनस वन पॉइंट वन वाई कॉस टू एक्स दिस कॉलम विल गिव अस माइनस जीरो पॉइंट थ्री एंड वाई साइन टू एक्स when we add it up we'll get minus 0.1732 following which let us find the coefficients uh for coefficients of the harmonic series so a not uh, is equal to 2 into the mean of f of x right so that's nothing but 2 into 8.7 divided by 6 that will give us 2.9 a1 is equal to 2 into the mean That's nothing but two into minus one point one divided by six. That's nothing but equal to zero point three six seven. कहाँ से आ रहे हैं ये numbers? It's nothing but these. ठीक है? So basically, for the a naught, we are taking the total of f of x. उसका mean ले रहे हैं, and then a one will be two into the mean. mean of y of cos of x and then we have a2 uh, we have b1 b1 is equal to 2 into the mean of y sin x right that is equal to 2 into what is y sin x 3.11 2 into 3.11 76 divided by 6 that's equal to 1.0392 then we have a2 a2 is equal to 2 into the mean of y cos x right mean of y cos x that's nothing but 2 into minus 0.3 divided by 6 that's minus 0.1 and b2 is equal to 2 into uh mean of y sin 2x that's equal to 2 into Minus zero point one seven three two divided by six. That's equal to minus zero point zero five seven seven. That's it. So your final step will be placing your values found into the main equation, like always. F of x is equal to a naught by two. What is your a naught? That's nothing but two point nine divided by two. Plus summation of a one, um, right? So that one will come out to be minus zero point three six seven cos x plus one point zero three nine two sine x minus zero point one into cos two x minus zero point zero five seven seven sine two x. Sorry for the handwriting for this last video. I was a little sleepy. So, yep. Good night. Bye-bye.